All right, welcome back. Today we got it. We got we got some moves going on. We got some big moves going on, and the move of today is we take a look at a storage unit um, because I want to modify the car in like a storage unit type of thing on some Paul Walker. You know, too fast, too furious. Whenever he brought out the skyline, you know, to pull up to the race. Right there. I locate, I, I want those type of vibes. So I look at the car storage unit because I'm like, I'm gonna be working on it and this stuff. And the storage unit I already called them. I asked them, I was like, what's our rules? Like, we're working on stuff. It was like, oh, as long as you like, you know, like clean up, have everything good, you can, you know, you can work on your car. So I'm like, all right, cool. Cause like, I'm gonna be ordering packages too. Like, I got, I got a lot of big stuff that I'm gonna be ordering. So I know I'm gonna need to have my own like storage unit and stuff. So. We finna go look at those real quick. I told the lady I was gonna be there around two. It's currently 2.56 and I got off at 2.30 and the place is like almost 30 minutes away. Uh, you can't see for real, but we leaving the storage unit. I uh, I ain't really recorded because like, first of all, it's just me and the lady. Like I literally never looked at storage units before. This is my first ever time. So it's kind of awkward. I'm just like, can I look at it before I like purchase it? Cause the thing was like a lot of money. So I was like, uh, I want to look at this before I just jump into anything. It was a, it was a cool, it was just standard storage unit, you know, like just, and it was hot in there too. They, they ain't got no outlets either. I don't know if most storage units got outlets, but they didn't. It was kind of hot in there. And the location the location is cool, but she was like, oh, I wouldn't recommend working on it at night because we can't, we got cameras, but we can't really see them. And I was like, hmm. So yeah, we definitely gonna look at some more units. <laughs> Probably try to find some cheaper or some, um, like what is at least the outlets, if any has outlets, I don't really know. But I'm definitely gonna look around a little bit more. But uh, yeah, so we're leaving that. It was cool though. Like, like if I, like, oh hold up. If I um end up not getting going uh to any other one, I'm definitely probably gonna get that one because uh. I mean, I can make some work. I'm really, I'm honestly just gonna be working on my car. Like, that's it. Like, I'm really just gonna be working on my car. I ain't really gonna have, like, my car there. So, I'm not really tripping, but yeah. So, um, I think I'm gonna head home, look up some more units, and, um, and I also work every day. But, but uh, besides the, the days I go to Chicago, but every other day I work. So, yeah, I gotta uh, see about all that, get everything planned out beforehand. And, um, yeah, because I'm ready to start working on this car. And, oh, I got to buy tools. Man, this stuff is going to get expensive. What's good, man? Welcome to day two of the storage unit hunting. I found one Um, that was actually close to me. And it's only like $151 a month. But the other one was like $190. So I was like, yeah, nah. Nah, and the location was stupid far. But this one... It ain't far, but it's still like a 12 minute drive or whatever. But yeah, so it was like 151. Hopefully I get it. I don't think I should have this camera by this gas pump, but I don't care. All right, we just bought the unit. Oh, hey man, how long is this? Well, good thing I'm driving. Damn, damn. Hey, I think you maybe have to unlock it. <laughs> oh, oh, come on, come over here. You think you could do your car here? Yeah. You should I bring you down here? Should I bring my car down here and see? No. Oh, come on. Oh, snap. Man. Hey, nigga, be on the route. How do a nigga hop on the beat? Let's see how this bitch looking. <laughs> Oh, snap. <laughs> hit you from the back. Wait, did he just say hit you from the back? No, he said Wait, like, like, no, no, no. They hit you or you hit them from the back? No, that's not what he said. Look, that's all you got to do, nigga. All right, what's good, man? We back at the storage unit, day two at the storage unit, man. I, I was gonna do some stuff yesterday, but bro, them, bro, they, they, they had to go somewhere, so we just had to cut it short. But 
Oh my God, bro, it's hot. We back here. Ugh. Uh, do I need two hands for this? I hope not, because these things far. Yeah, probably just one. Hmm. Boy, y'all see it? Like, what? Oh, hold up. I'm tripping. That's my fault. I didn't unlock it. Oh, I'm tripping. I, I thought my stuff was. Oh, this thing. The DGK banner still up. Oh, there's a spider web. But yeah, today we finna um, we finna expect the bumper because as you can see, we got some dents. And if you can see that, we my my bumper is hanging on by literally nothing. There's no clips. I just pop it into. It. You feel me, bro? Because the hurricane that came from Houston or whatever, we had stupid rain. One side of my bumper was already off. So, um. I was driving fast to work because I was late. A big old splash of water came, knocked my whole bumper clean off. But I was like, what? So yeah, now I gotta get a new fender liner and the um, splash plate. All right, I'm looking at my car in a storage unit. It's not my ideal size, but it'll do. Size of my horrendous parking, man. This side, I ain't got that much room on this side, but this side, I got, I, got, I got stupid room to open my doors and all that. That's good, though, but, yeah. Hey, that's what I need to do. I need to get new lighting. I need to get more tools. I'm going to bag back a little bit more. Blue lighting. I think that's about it. And a fan, a fan, a fan. Yeah, that, that. I need a fan bad. It is hot in here. But, yeah. Ooh. Look at that. Who not, who not a go that parking, man? Who's not a goat? <sighs> I low-key don't want to take this off, but at the same time, I, I have to. I mean, I don't really have to because I'm getting a new bumper. Like, this one cool, wait. Cause um, this one cool, I think this comes off too. Like, uh, cause, okay, I, I'm not gonna lie, I'm just, I'm just gonna tell y'all because, um, I don't know, I, I hate when I don't tell y'all, oh yeah, I gotta wait and stay tuned. No, I'm gonna tell y'all right now. I seen this one bumper on Facebook Marketplace, but it's a different color though. And it has these, like the, these things gone. These come off my bumper too, but my bumper shot. Like, bro, I'm looking at it. It's worse than I thought. Like, look at all this, all these scratches, bugs and stuff. Come on, you clean it off. But like more scratches, a big old dent. Like, and a bumper I saw on Facebook Marketplace, it was red. But it had those things missing, so I was like, okay, I can put some fog lights in there. I ain't gonna tell y'all what I'm gonna do, like, initially with the fog lights and stuff, but I'm telling y'all right now, I'm getting a new bumper for uh, the car. Because um, this car, I'm gonna have to, if I want to keep this bumper, I'm gonna have to get the dents and scratches all out, get it repainted, which I'm already gonna get it repainted, but like, getting the dents and stuff, I was gonna be a waste of money and time because I'm just gonna get a new bumper anyways. And plus, that one is in mint condition, like. But yeah, I'm finna look at this bumper real quick, see if I got all the clips, because I'm finna order the fender liners. But yeah, so I'm finna take off the bumper real quick. Uh, this might be one of the worst or best ideas I have, because I ain't got no clips, so. But yeah. Look at that. Easy. Okay, you just stay up. And also, I have, ooh. Ooh, 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 I forgot about that. There's another clip. There's a clip hanging on. Okay, I'll just leave it like this, and we can just look inside real quick. But yeah, so, and also, I, I got a rant about this. Bro, these grills, you cannot get a non-debadged one. Like, you cannot get a debadged one at all. I mean, that's what I meant. You cannot get a debadged one, bro. Like, my car, I'm gonna tell y'all right now, I'm gonna debadge this car completely. This grill, like the 8th Gen Civic, they don't have no debadges for it. They only got it for the Sudans, they don't got it for the coupes. So, I gotta uh, DIY um, this when I debadge all of it. I'm debadging this whole car. Because I don't know, like, I know um, 
I know I know people be blacking out their badges, but me, I want to go a D badge route because I don't know. The car probably gonna, it's gonna look better. Like I don't want a brand on it. I want it my own. You feel me? But um, it looks like all the clips are in place. This one broke off. Yeah, that one uh right here. My fault. The camera was zoomed in, but this one broke. Um, everything else look mint for real, for real. Well. This completely gone. I don't know about this. I think this one, yeah, I think this one broke too. I don't know. Cause I'm not seeing yep. So this whole top grill gone. Probably gotta get a new um top grill, which I am when I DIY it. And also give me some new paint ideas. Like I might just continue sticking with the uh I think my paint called diamond black. It's a civic color, like diamond black or something. But I don't know, cause I know people usually wrap their cars, but come on now, man. This is a 2009 Honda. I'm not finna. It's, ain't wrap more expensive than paint. I know. I know certain paint expensive. Like, you know, if you really want to go all out with it, you know, get some metallic in there, or whatever. But yeah, camera overheating, so I'm finna pop this bumper back on. Give the Honda dealership a call. Ask him about my cigarette lighter and um my key fob. Cause if y'all remember. This thing hanging on by some tape, bro. So yeah, I'm finna put the camera down real quick. Give Honda a call. Ooh, snap, let's turn off that. We at AutoZone right now. I gotta get a fuse puller because I just got off the phone with Honda. And then, bro, I asked them how much for a new key. They tell me some like 80, 80, 80 something, right? And then they was like, it's your battery dead. I was like, oh no. They was like, oh, if it is, plus 184. Damn near $300 for a new key fob. And the key, like to get it programmed. I mean, yeah, I get it programmed and all that. But they was like, they was like, if yo, uh, if you need your battery replaced and your clips and like match, whatever, bro. They said like eighty four, so I might be spending just eighty four dollars. But if I got to get a whole new battery program to my stuff, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm gonna be, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna cry, cause that's like, that's almost like six hundred dollars for new fenders and a new key. In total, like what? But yeah, let's go get this fuse puller. Bag secured. All right, I think this is the right fuse. I'm hoping, but if it if it is, bro, look at that. That mug is completely shot. All right, so bro, literally, hold up. I grabbed this uh, fuse puller, bro. It did not work. These they gave me some needle tip. I think it's called pliers, and I just. Like, boop, like it was, it was satisfying. I wish I would've showed it on camera. But anyways, the moment of truth, I had to replace this fuse. I grabbed the right one. I made sure it was the right one. I was even on the phone with the Honda dealership and they told me which one to pull. So, um, oh, I forgot this charger broke. My boy, typical gamer didn't upload it had to clear that real quick all right moment of truth bro moment of truth phone plugged in we got this let's see You gotta be kidding me, no! Bro, it's, it's a much deeper issue than just my car. I mean, it's, it's my car now. It's not the fuse, it's literally my car. Man? Bro, I literally replaced the fuse and everything. What? Bro, there's a whole fuse in here.
Bro, my car is is my f bro is my car. It's my car now. But I replaced the fuse though. Like, why is it? All right, mm, O'Reilly's. We finna, I, cause I could go back to AutoZone, bro. I, he already gave me a free fuse. I ain't wanna walk back in there and be like, oh yeah, can you give me another free? I ain't wanna do that. So yeah, we at O'Reilly's. I'm finna just get, a, um, I'm just finna get another 15 A fuse. See if that worked. But yeah, they said if that doesn't work, unplug it and try a new fuse. So I'm just finna go in here get some pliers get a 15a uh fuse and if that doesn't work then i ain't got no cigarette lighter in this car and i'm not gonna pay 194 what are you laced i'm not doing that yeah everything's secure man let's just i'm i just spent 16 dollars i'm basically spending all i just basically spent almost 40 dollars for a cigarette lighter so, I mean, I'll, I'll take this though. This can always, this always gonna be with me though. You feel me? I, I, I can use a tool. You feel me? I can use pliers, man. Like, come on now. Okay, I just replaced it again for the love of King of Neptune. Please work. Please work. That's all I want. That's all I want. That's all I want, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yep. It's my car. Alright, man. I'm going to see y'all in the next video. I'm just going to end it right here. Uh, Like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to have to go to somebody because I'm not paying $194. You got me all the way messed up. But yeah. Love y'all. Stay safe out there. See you. What's his name? What's his name? What's his name? What's his name? Um, the RB, um, RB, the mechanic, bro. Shout out to you. Hold up, it's not even working. Ads, bro. All right. What other few? Shout out to to this dude right here, bro. RB mechanic. Literally, him right here, bro. Shout out to you, bro. Cause I was literally on my way home, mad, frustrated, thinking I'm gonna be out like three hundred dollars. I'm like, bro, what's going on? I type in eighth gen, uh, eighth gen Honda Civic cigarette cigarette lighter fuse. He said, make sure you check both of them. Um, okay, hop in my car. I change out the fuse next to the uh, other one. Good thing it was a fifteen A, and I had to go to the other stores and spend more money. But I just pulled it out the pliers, popped in that fifteen. It worked. Oh, bro, I'm I'm so hyped. Oh my goodness, I'm so hyped. Now I can now I can get what I finally been trying to get. <sighs> bro, shout out to you, RB the mechanic, bro. You you really saved me, man. Cause I was literally you just saved me countless of dollars, man. Like. <sighs> I didn't even think about grabbing two. Like, and I then I seen a TikTok earlier too, of bro talking about some how it is like when you work on cars, you like you know you go to lay down, and then you think about the problem that you having, and then it come to your head, and then you wake up, you know, and then you go check it out, and the problem end up solving itself. Well, I ain't have that. I, I went to the internet, so, but still, I feel like I feel like man, I was literally like so mad. I was like, 
listen to Deftones, just, just vibe. And well, I wasn't even singing it. That's how mad I was. Because usually when Deftones on, a voice gone. But I was just like, you know, I was still vibing, but... Tch. Dang. I just fixed my first car problem. First car problem. Like, changing the tire. Come on. Then that's nothing. I ain't changed my oil yet. I need to change my oil, though. I'm going to change it soon when I get this paycheck. Because your boy sitting at 15% of oil. Life here. But, yeah. So, I feel like a brand new man. I'm at this current... <laughs> uh. Um, animal, dog, groomer, shelter, parking lot. So let me go home before they look at me like, what is he doing? And I'm screaming too. So yeah, let's hurry up, boy. Oh, oh, we did it. I'm so hyped. All right, man. Love y'all. Stay safe out there, man. And enjoy y'all day. Remember, never give up on your problems. You don't, if you give up. How'd that quote go? It's not over until you give up. Remember that. Love y'all. Peace out.